is what it looks like before I've done anything to it. I prefer elastic drawstrings just because they're more comfortable for me. The shoe doesn't pinch as much as with cotton drawstrings where there's no give. I have elastic, which Grace Ann Powers taught me to double up before you even start to make sure the shoe can't move too much and stretch too far away from your heel. I sew it to the outside edge and sew it to the other edge of the shoe. And I prefer it this way just because this keeps the shoe flat against my foot a little bit better. So that's the elastic placement. As far as the ribbons go, I almost always sew my ribbons on the outside to make sure the shoe comes with me. Sometimes if I sew it on the inside, there's a gap. These are elastic ribbons. They are so much more comfortable than satin ribbons for me. They don't pinch my Achilles tendon when I'm dancing. Just take the ribbon, burn the edge of it just a little bit to make sure it doesn't fray. There's an inseam on the shoe. I've learned that my ideal placement for my ribbons is right underneath that inseam. I make sure that it's where I want it to be. Usually go along the top perimeter and then down the bottom. The same way I burned and melted the edges of the inside to make sure it doesn't fray, I do the same with the outside just to try and keep it from fraying. That's it, that's one sewn point shoe and it's ready for whenever we return to rehearsals.